Hey guys, it's Illnick here. And um, K Kane 0317, I think that's how you say his name, please correct me if I'm wrong, uh, said if I could do a video of how to save in Beyblade. And um, I, just want, I just wanted to show you how to do that real quick because I have a lot to do tomorrow. A lot of videos are probably going to be uploaded or the day after, like episode 5 and 6 of my walkthrough and uh, tons of battles because I'm due for them and so I just wanted to show that real quick okay so after you beat any character in the game of your, in your story and it's brought to a screen where it says status equipped and next stage not, that can't be, it's not just this one it could be anyone you just press press back and it says saving do not turn off the power or take out game card and you just turn off the game so I turned it off and I kind of, if you press it quick it'll bring you back to the screen this is for the deaths for the DSI press it might want to fast forward through this because it's gonna it makes me do this I just want to block this out because I don't know if it's copyright infringement. Okay. So then you're brought to this off the screen. Pick your data. Data 2. Loading, load complete. Story. Start. And look what it does. It says load, load a saved file. But if you click any other, if you press no and click any other character, um, it'll say delete old save file. And if you do that, it'll delete your past character's story. Even if you beat um, or or beat Crow, it would delete that and you would go to this. Even though you keep all the characters, it would just delete all the progress you made for that one character. So if you click load, load to save file, save complete. Bam, you brought me back to the same screen that you saw earlier. So that's basically how to save. It's kind of like an auto save feature. And so yeah, that's pretty much it. So this, been, so this has been, and goodbye.